Hello YouTubers, it's Champion DJK coming at you again with another video, and uh, this is going to be episode 22 um, of my weekly update video, so thanks for sticking with me. I'm um, just going to show you what I got this week, so uh, without further ado, let's get right into it. Found some cool stuff this week, um, and I got some stuff for some, from some friends too. Uh, let's see here, so first of all, I'll show you a couple majorettes. I got these from my buddy Todd who had to make a trip up to Canada uh, and picked up these two. So we got a Porsche and we got this Jag. We're going to go ahead and open these. I'm going to open up the Porsche first. So Really cool. I like the, uh, the racing uh, tampo scheme on this one. Looks pretty nice. This one's like a basic majorette, so there's no, um, no suspension or anything. It's a plastic base, metal body, plastic tires, uh, pretty cool looking car. So there's that one, and then we got uh, the Jaguar F-Type, and this is in the Premium Series, so it's got some added feature to it. Um, there it is. Tires are plastic, but they look really nice. Um, this one's got opening doors which is pretty neat. The interior is actually very detailed, not like painted or anything, but there's a lot of detail in it. And uh, this one's got some uh, Majorette suspension, which is really cool. So there is that one. And then of course we got to do a comparison to the orange Jag that we got from uh, Matchbox this year. It came out about the same time, and here that is. Here's the Matchbox version. You got painted um, headlights and taillights on there. Of course, no opening doors. And then here is this version where you got uh, lens detail in the front, painted detail in the rear. Um, this one also has a full metal um, roof. This one's got like the clear roof to it. So um, definitely the majorettes, pretty awesome. This one is probably five bucks US dollars is what I think it roughly translates to um, if you uh, with the exchange rate so there's that so just wanted to show those a couple of majorettes to you um, next I found some uh, some of these guys not in the set I already cracked this one so I wanted to get some singles of these cars to crack you guys have already seen these but it's a Forza series um, so I picked up the, the GT because I wanted one of those loose I picked up this sweet Lambo because I want one of those loose That is, this one is just really sweet. The wheels on it are great. Just a great looking casting. Very, very awesome to have one of those loose. And then of course, this one's the highlight for most people in the series. And uh, either this or the 4G, I would say, 4, 4 GT, I would say for most people. And there's this guy, this thing's just beautiful. Really cool car, this Alpha. So there's those. So we got a couple of those. Let's see here. That um, did a small commission custom for somebody, and uh, they sent me some stuff, including a custom. So shout out to uh, you, bud. Doesn't do YouTube videos, and he's not on Instagram. But pretty cool. J Apple. So this is a custom Firebird he made for me that he just threw in. So this is pretty awesome. I was not expecting to get it. So really cool. Thank you very much for sending that my way. Um, sent me a panel bus that I'll probably just do a custom with. Um, sent me this highway hauler, which was like a cereal promo or something. It's got Cocoa Puffs, Cookie Crisp, Count Chocula, and Reese's on it. So there's that guy. Bah, bah. And then uh, we got Ferrari Testarossa. This one I need loose. I already have one carded. It's in good shape. So we'll go ahead and open it up. So there's their Testarossa. Basic wheels. Looking pretty nice. Add that to the loose Testarossa collection, which is right behind me. Put it in there. And then uh, I got this GTO Ultra Red, which he sent me. This thing is sweet. Might crack this one open at a later date. The card's not in the greatest of shape. 
Um, but I love Ultra Reds, so after Ultra Reds. Um, then another guy, I sold my um, that Bandit 1977 Trans Am uh, 124 scale Bandit Green Machine that I found. Uh, I sold it for some cash, and he threw in this uh, Ultra Red Corvette loose. So there's that. This thing is awesome. Um, it's got an opening hood, of course. Very detailed engine, as you can see in there. Uh, but this is just really cool, so really cool to get this loose. Then I don't have to debate on whether or not to crack it, because it's already cracked, which is nice. No, in no internal debate on that one. So there you go. There's that. Okay, so that's pretty cool. So two Ultra Reds this week. Um, scored big time at Toys R Us. Found this gold GTR. Which is awesome. So really cool to find that one. And then I found two dioramas. I found the uh, Volkswagen one I wanted. And I will crack this at a later date. Here's the summer Volkswagen one. Really cool. Cool cars in there. And then I found a Chase. I found this raw campsite one. And uh, this one I've already started to open. I'm not going to fully open it here, but I'm just going to take it out just to see. There they are. All raw, green tires. Pretty cool. Um, two of these castings in it are getting traded to Lamar Fashion. Shout out to you, bud. I'm keeping the VW and the dudes, and I'll probably trade that Jeep away. So if someone's interested in that loose, I might trade it to you. I already offered it to somebody, but I haven't gotten a response yet, so we'll see what happens. Um, so there's that. Found some new Racing Champions Series 2. Um, this one's really cool. These were 25% off at Toys R Us. Plus, if you use your Toys R Us credit card on Saturdays now through the holidays, you get an additional 10% off. So I got these for about 4 bucks a piece. Not too bad. Um, that Bronco is awesome. I'm definitely going to try to get that in the other color when that comes out. I think it's blue and white. But this two-tone brown looks pretty awesome, too. And this Plymouth GTX just, I don't know, looks cool. Not a huge GTX fan or whatever, you know, but uh, I just thought this looked really, really nice, so I had to pick it up. So there's that. Also got on sale at, this was at the Target up in Green Bay. I got this guy. These were on sale for, I think these were 25% off, actually. So I got those. And I got this guy too, which I passed this one up a bunch of times, but I saw it for cheap and I decided to go ahead and pick it up. Um, interesting thing about this one is it's got the sticker. The sticker was removed that said Walmart only on it, and it's not a return. They got a full case, and they got a full case of the ones with the Walmart stickers. A buddy up in Green Bay actually alerted me to the fact that he just picked up the Trans Am, the one that is a Walmart exclusive with the, uh, the chicken on the hood. And he found it at Target, and it looked like they just had ripped off the stickers. So I wonder if they got shipped a case that they weren't supposed to have, and then they went ahead and just ripped off the stickers and put them on the shelf anyway. So that's what I'm guessing happened. But uh, So he picked up a Walmart exclusive, exclusive Trans Am at a Target. So there's that. Um, I also found the Mario series, and uh, the only one I really cared for out of it is this Superman. So I picked up a couple of these. And got to have one loose to throw in my Superman collection. Love the Superman. Of course, it's one of my favorite castings, so it's pretty cool. You got a different image on each side, but had to pick it up. It's a Superman, so that's awesome. And then, let's see here. We also got, just finally here, quickly, I got mail from Hot Wheels. There's a K-Day mail-in. Mailed in for one of these, and just got it this week. So there's that. It's pretty cool. And then I got some new Matchbox. Um, I got a Porsche Panamera. There were no Skylines. I don't know if there is a Skyline in this case, in this assortment, or not. But I got this cool Chevy truck. This just looks awesome on these wheels. Wheels are massive. And it just looks great. Lifted truck. Pretty cool. I picked up two of these. So there's that. And then I picked up a couple of these Lambos which I have two other ones in different police libraries. Liveries. They're actually right behind me. So there's that one.
that one, and now that one. This one's probably the coolest one so far. Um, like the tampos, really like the wheels on it too. It looks really good. All right, so that's gonna be about it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I didn't get any customs done at all this week, really. Um, so nothing really to show you on that front. Um, of course, the coolest thing I probably found was this was this raw, and I can't wait to get these things loose out of here. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, man, if I could find the raw of this one though, I'd be super stoked. So there's that, and. Uh, that's going to be pretty much it. So, thank you guys again for watching another weekly episode. You guys have an excellent week. And, uh, yeah, hope you find some stuff you like. And uh, have a good one. Thank you.